Much of what we previously knew about the Ford Everest was based on prototypes. The design, especially the front part, of course, is reminiscent of the Ford Ranger and the already stylish and modern utilitarian Ford Maverick pickup. Acquired elements include C-shaped headlights and a redesigned front grille, among other things. The grille now houses a camera, part of the 360-degree system. The design also incorporates available driver assistance functions and a radar system for dynamic cruise control. Also, you'll find tow hooks, although it remains to be seen if they'll be standard items. The new Everest also gets a 50mm increase in wheelbase, which allows for better approach angles, which is crucial when going off-road. The front fenders have functional heat extractors and a plastic insert with the engine designation on it. Other notable changes get redesigned mirrors with LED turn signals and a new set of running boards for easy access. Moving to the rear, the tailgate is new and gets more sculpted than before. A new pair of taillights complete the look, very stylish and cohesive. The new Everest supports over-the-air updates and connected car technology that allows owners to remotely control some of the truck's various features. In terms of technology, the new Everest comes with matrix LED headlamps and radar-assisted cruise control with the latest safety mechanisms on board. Customers will be able to choose between two all-wheel drive systems, either an electronic shift system or a more sophisticated full-time 4x4 system. International models get a range of engine options, a 3.0-liter V6 diesel and a pair of smaller 2.0-liter four-cylinder diesels with single and twin turbos. Power figures for the base 2-liter diesel configuration are around 168 to 207 horsepower, while the V6 makes 246 horsepower with plenty of torque, 443 pounds to foot to be specific. For certain markets, a 2.3-liter EcoBoost turbocharged four-cylinder is available in many vehicles, from the Ford Mustang to many crossovers and SUVs, but the power output is not readily available. This engine makes 310 horsepower in the Ford Mustang, so while the Everest size and weight may reduce acceleration a bit, customers can expect decent performance. Depending on the engine configuration, there will be a 6-speed manual or the latest 10-speed automatic. Currently, the 2023 Ford Everest is available on Ford's various international websites with the ability to build and customize your new SUV while adding accessories. Most countries don't offer the EcoBoost engine, and so diesel is the main theme here. If it were to go on sale in the US, the EcoBoost turbocharged gas engine would no doubt be offered. In late October this year, Ford Thailand gave us a new press release on the safety and performance of the Everest's LED matrix headlights, which offer a glare-free beam. Oh, 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 oh,